Boris Johnson cast doubt on the idea of vaccine passports today saying it could be discriminatory against people who genuinely refuse jabs. The PM cited serious concerns about the prospect, despite ordering Michael Gove to carry out a review of whether a system of COVID certificates can be used to help reopen the UK. Supporters say the concept could help theatres, cinemas, sporting venues and workplaces get up and running again. One option understood to be on the table would see businesses able to check tests results on the NHS app. But on a visit to a school in South London this morning Mr Johnson said there were deep and complex issues involved in taking the novel step. We can't be discriminatory against people who for whatever reason people can't have the vaccine, there might be medical reasons why people can't have a vaccine, he said. Or some people may genuinely refuse to have one. I think that's a mistake. I think everybody should have a vaccine, but we need to thrash all this out. Meanwhile, Sir Jonathan Montgomery, who has led an evidence review into vaccine passports, said the idea would come too late to save summer because people would need two jabs to qualify and most young people won't have both until the autumn. The University College London professor of healthcare law told BBC Radio Force Today program that there were three problems his research team had identified. He said, the first is the scientific one does it work, and that all depends on this information about risk of transmission. The second is a timing issue. We need to reopen the economy as quickly as it's safe to do so, and vaccine passports are not going to be useful until people have had their second vaccine. Summer holidays abroad could begin from May 17th, but people won't know if they will be able to get away until April. A task force will report on when international travel can restart by April 12th, the Prime Minister said yesterday. But whatever its findings, curbs cannot begin being lifted earlier than May 17. The travel industry last night said the blueprint would boost people's confidence to book foreign summer holidays and allow the hard-hit sector to prepare for a summer reopening. Announcing the roadmap in the Commons, Boris Johnson said there was every chance of an aviation recovery later on this year. The document also made clear talks with foreign officials over possible vaccine passports to get Britain's flying again will be ramped up. But it said restarting international travel will depend on the prevalence of COVID strains and their impact on vaccine effectiveness. It said, the government does not expect this solution to be available quickly and restrictions like those in place across the world are likely to continue for the near future. Greece, Spain, and Cyprus have so far expressed interest in a vaccine certification system.